Hi everyone and welcome to Boston Logan Airport. Kind of a weird place to feature in my week all about Grand Rapids, but we're flying to Grand Rapids now. And to get from Gerald R. Ford Airport into the city, we're gonna take a new form of public transportation in Grand Rapids. The airport used to be connected to the Woodland Mall in GR by bus Route 27. Used to be called Route 17, was rerouted 27. And five or six times a day, the 27 still stops at the airport, but the rest of the day, passengers have to use the Rapid Connect service. So what is Rapid Connect? Rapid Connect is an app on my phone that lets me basically hail a ride anywhere within what they call the Kentwood area. It's also available in the Walker area and it's like an it's it's a mobility on demand service that we're gonna try today. So let's get on our flight and then we'll be in Grand Rapids in about two hours. If you love train travel hit that subscribe button. We upload at least once a week and this way you won't miss any of our content. You can also join our community on Patreon. Your support gives you access to cool features such as early video releases. And finally, follow us on our social media, Instagram and TikTok. We've made it to Gerald R. Ford International Airport in Grand Rapids, Michigan. While the plane was taxiing to the gate, I made sure to use the Rapid Connect app to hail a ride. Put in the airport as our origin and the Woodland Mall as our destination since that allows us to transfer to a number of different bus routes. The Rapid Connect service leaves from the Kiss and Ride slash bus stop area out in front of the airport. Made it to the Kiss and Ride slash bus stop area of Ford Airport. And hi Lindsay. <laughs> we, um, this is where we're gonna be picked up by the Rapid Connect. I hailed it on my app and Lindsay actually had to download the app separately I mean, as excited as I am to try Rapid Connect, I really wish that they hadn't cut back regular bus service so much. And I also really think that there should be like a straight connection to downtown. Like, Once you hail a ride on the Rapid Connect app, which each passenger has to do separately, it gives you a window of about 20 minutes in which the shuttle can arrive. Ours got there right at the beginning at about 11.35, which was really great. The driver was super friendly, making conversation with us about the places we were coming from. Our other passenger just came from London, England, so naturally he stole the show. A ride on Rapid Connect costs $1.75 just like other bus routes and it provides free transfers if you transfer to a different bus afterwards. Soon we arrived at Kentwood Station which is conveniently located next to the Woodland Mall. This is the departure station for routes 5, 6, 24, 27, 28, and 29, and 44. That was Grand Rapids' newest mobility on demand service, Rapid Connect. I enjoyed it. The app was very easy to use. Um, the ride was fast. The driver was very friendly. Uh, the seats were comfortable. We're gonna take Route 6, my favorite route, uh, farther into the city. Thanks for watching today. Please remember to subscribe to Trains Are Awesome and we'll see you next time.